Let's see. Right now we're looking at a hippopotamus swimming in there. If you see where Hmm. When will it submerge? I'm following a rift in the Here it is. It's it's coming out. I see the hippo. I couldn't get him. I think he's in the water. Waiting. It's in the water. Ah, it's it's submerging. It's rising. It's in the water there. It's gonna come. Here it comes. He's gonna come up in a minute. I know. Because he has to get air. Watch. It's going to come up any second now. You can probably even see it right now on the camera. It has to come up for at some point. It's going for the record on breathing underwater, apparently. Here it comes. Man, this one's either suicidal or it's going for the record. There it is. Oh, I came up for a minute. There it is, there's the back end. You guys wanna go see the giraffe? Well, why don't we see the giraffe and we'll come back and we'll see if the hippo is out of the water. Well, that's it for now. I'll let you, I'll let you know if we see any, it again in better view. Look, we're in hippo. Will it jump? Will it jump? Here we have some Australian kangaroos. Nice that they managed to get these in here. Thank you. Oh, there's some right here. I didn't even see those. See the picture? But we got some really up close gate. here. I couldn't get them except by the gate. So I'm going to get rid of that picture if I need to. And then there's some far away. Wow. What? Is it just me or does it look like those two are... Oh, okay. Good. From afar, it looks kind of weird. Anyway. Let's move on. Okay, guys, come on. Oh, it's not far now. All right, my turn, guys. Come Over here. Come on. Let's see if we can find any more, or maybe a sign. Ah, here it is. The first fleet of British ships arrived in Australia in 1788. Soon after, other Europeans followed, like Aborigines. The first explorers hunted kangaroos for survival for meat and skins. In the 1840s, Europeans explored Australia's interior area, 
the outback, far from the sea coast looking for a legendary inland sea. Everyone believed that the landmass as large as, as Australia, which is about the, the same size as the continental United States, must have a large body of fresh water within. They were. It, tur it turned out quite wrong. All they found was desert, desert, and more desert. Most of the settlers ended up living in areas along Australia's sea coast where they found lots of freshwater vegetation and land that could be farmed, where they could raise non-native cattle and sheep they brought with them from Europe. How do you think you would feel? Hmm, that's a good question. Leave it in your comment page. In my comment page. Here we have some koi fish, and yes, I, I know you can see them because I can see them through the screen of the camera. There's some up close. There's supposed to be some. There's supposed to be some turtles in here, but they're hidden away. Now, if you could only pet fish without their slime coat being torn apart, which protects them from infection and stuff, ironically. Well, where's the turtle? I don't see a turtle. Sorry, I'll move. Okay. So there's the little fishies. Let the sight of them soothe you. And the sound of that waterfall right over there. He's still right here. Just for those who are wondering what I was whistling, that was the super black bass for the SNES Enter Your Password screen music. Moving on. Here we have some prairie dogs. And no, they, they're not related to canines, canines at all. Hmm. Apparently you can venture in there and pop out like they do. Maybe I'll go do that. Sentry duty. Yeah, what a surprise. Sentries usually you will notice some prairie dogs standing upright. They will bark a warning and call to others if danger approaches. Body language. Since many prairie dogs live together in large communities, they need to communicate. Can you understand their various body postures or vocalization? Town entrances. The prairie dog town exists mostly below ground. This complex burrow system features many different rooms, including food storage areas, sleeping rooms, and toilets. Habitat range. Prairies of North America, wild diet, like many other rodents, prairie dogs feel, feed on grasses and their roots. Predators are hawks, snakes, black-footed ferrets, and humans. Reproduction, three to five pups are born after gestation of one month. Prairie dogs are mature at one year and live for three to five years. Conservation status stable.